new on YouTube. Hey, pretty easy way to extend your compressor capability storage-wise. 26 gallon tank picked up off Craigslist for 20 bucks because uh, somebody had tried the oilless compressor motor assembly. Now I have a 100% duty cycle, 26 gallon, 120 volt compressor. Um, it provides me enough juice to a little bit of sandblasting, nailers, die grinders. I'm running the die grinder a long time. Uh, it doesn't keep up. But I'm just a DIY guy, right? But every once in a while, I need more capacity. Uh, a couple of days ago, I cut a bunch of steel with a plasma cutter in very humid summer weather. And the main tank, doing what the main tank does, and then pump the excess into here, and I get uh, double capacity. By the time the air gets into here, it's lost most of its moisture in the main tank. Uh, what little air there is left stays in this tank, and by the time I run the plasma cutter, uh, I've got no moisture issues. So, you can valve it, and you can put your fittings on it, and if you run big three-quarter impacts occasionally, um, you can outfit the plumbing on here. You don't need to use it all the time. You can keep it in the shed. You can keep it in the corner of the garage. But every once in a while, when a DIYer needs to have a tank, more capacity. It's a nice way to go. Low cost, 20 bucks. They, they're on Craigslist all the time. Burnt compressor motors, they're selling the tank only. Or if you've got a little more fabrication skill, you can do the same thing with a propane tank. 100, 100 gallon propane tank or so. Um, also a nice thing about this is that I can leave the compressor in the garage and I can run this thing very simply anywhere on the property have a line running from the garage to here uh, and then a short line from here to the tool and then the long run from the main compressor doesn't degrade my tool performance because I've got a nice reservoir here an air buffer to take care of the tool right then and there and the long line from the compressor can fill it up as needed. It's a nice way to go. Uh, you don't need a big compressor all the time. Boy, I tell you what, when you when you need the extra space or you want to pull moisture out of the air because you're cutting with the plasma. These little $20 tanks you can get on Craigslist all day long, uh, they're a good bargain. 